What's poppin' T-Squad? It's me, Keisha, and I'm here with the College Hill Celebrity Edition trailer. You know, College Hill has been on my tongue, especially um, pretty much over like the last six or seven months with the resurgence of Lisa Milan from College Hill South Beach being on Real Housewives of Dubai. I did a Where Are They Now on her. I'm going to go back to my Where Are They Now series and see what's going on with the other members of College Hill. I have been saying for years that I wanted BET to bring back College Hill. And they somewhat answered my prayers. They have brought the show back. But they haven't brought the show back in a way that I thought they would, how they would scout for college students and put them in a house together and follow their lives. This time they have decided to put together a house filled with celebrities and have them go through the college experiment, experience. Sorry, excuse me. Um, <clears throat> I like the idea a lot, but I wish that they would do both a college hill celebrity edition and the regular college hill. I think that it would be super lit to bring it back, especially now with the, uh, times that we are in, because when it was on back in the two thousands, it was just so groundbreaking and so good. I actually went back to watch the South beach season and I had forgot about so much stuff that had happened that season was everything but let's see what this trailer is giving us this season they will have slim thug dream doll india love ray j lamar odom big frida nene leaks and stacy dash but a little behind the scenes t stacy dash actually drops out <laughs> Ah, let's get into this trailer. BET is back with College Hill, the celebrity edition. Welcome to Texas Southern University. Yeah. This is a welcome to HBCU. Eight celebrities will take on their biggest challenges yet. You are now official members of Tiger Nation. It's definitely been a challenge, but I'm... I'm here. They're about to learn that going back to college comes with its own set of issues. Our first class is African American studies with other TSU students. The information that we're going to be exchanging is going to elevate our souls. Does everybody self-identify as black in here? Stacy Dash is taking African American studies. This should be interesting. Who's most likely to argue with the professor? It's me and Ray. You can't come dressed like that. As a suit. No, absolutely not, ma'am. Over the course of the next week, you are going to be engaging in a dissection. I can't be cutting no pet pig. That's against my religion. Oh! It broke. <laughs> no, Frida. Right now, I'm literally panicking. You no, know, living with my classmates. Uh, Some of them are just... Oh, Ew! my... Y'all. I never seen his room look tidy. I just see my friend take a piss and walk out and try to give me a high five. <laughs> what you mean you didn't wash your hands? I'm a grown ass man. I ain't gonna pee on my hands. I'm gonna keep it 100. I've never been able to kick it with nobody like you. It really don't matter to me. I know who I am. Stacy Dash ain't talking to nobody. Come on, Stacy. Hi, Dr. Cooley. Good evening. We just want to make sure that we have everything that we need to, before we turn in our presentation. They trying to do a video and make somebody edit it. That's cheating. Like, they can't get somebody to edit it. You well, told Dr. Cooley that we sit up here talking to somebody professional, and you are too. No. What you trying to do was throw us under the bus in some slick kind of way. Oh, my God. I just got an email from Dr. Cooley. Saying what? The grades will be up on the screen. Will these celebrities make the grade? I don't even want to see this. I'm panicking, y'all. This gonna be a disaster. College Hill Celebrity Edition, streaming exclusively on BET+. I must say I'm liking what I'm seeing. I'm happy, of course, that they are promoting HBCUs. It'll be good to see Lanithia Nene Leaks back on our television screen. I think just her and Ray J being in the house period is going to be hilarity at its best. Lamar Odom is just trifling. He is just trifling 
trifling trifling lamar odom is the epitome of taking somebody out the hood and giving them money and they still are just dirty as hell i'll never forget that season of keeping up with the kardashians when he was married to chloe and kim was like do you guys smell that what does that smell and she was like lamar like that is your breath what is going on she was like i bet you have a cavity i can smell cavities she was like, open your mouth. She That man opened his mouth and Kim damn near melted. She was like, oh, my God, you need to get that fixed. Oh, my God, your tooth is rotting. And I'm like, if she smelled that, that I know Chloe smelled it and was just over here putting up with the bullshit, which says a lot about Chloe. But um, seeing how he was on Celebrity Big Brother, sharting on himself and Putin and just just disgusting like money can't buy your class money can't buy your class elegance is learned my friend like somebody needs to play him countess luann's song because that man is disgusting um the only other thing that really gives me qualms is that this will only be on BET Plus. So if you don't have the app, you can't watch it. I think that this should have been on actual BET. I think that the audience would have been way bigger. But I do understand that they're trying to get more people to come over to the app or whatever. I do have the BET Plus app. I think it's like $4.99 a month. I got pretty much every app there is, child. These people are robbing me blind. But I will be tuning in um, hopefully after it airs on the BET Plus app that they'll show it on regular BET for those who don't have the app. So we shall see. I'm super excited about this show. I can't wait to watch it. I think it's going to be fun. I think it's just going to be a funny, entertaining show. And it'll be good to see India Love on the screen. Remember, she had her reality show on BET years ago. They only had one season. So it'll be good to see where she's at right now. Dream Doll, I can't wait to see how much she has grown since her Bad Girls Club season. And Slim Thug recently just sat down with his ex-girlfriend or ex-fiance, Latoya Luckett, on Latoya Luckett's new YouTube channel. And they discussed um, their past relationship and if there is, you know, a chance for them to rekindle things now. And it was a really good interview. And in that interview, baby, he was sexy as that one thing. And I was like, oh, okay, hey, Slim. So it's going to be good to see him. And shout out to Big Frida. She is out here doing a damn thing. You know, her. Uh, she's featured on Beyonce's new song. So this is just a great look for B Big Frida. And Stacey Dash is just once again an embarrassment. Child, fuck her. Anywho, so excited about College Hill Celebrity Edition. Let me know how you guys feel about the trailer down below in the comment section. Make sure to thumbs up this video, like, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell button, you guys. I love you, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye!